Day worked with our district last year at another uh, school within our district. It was a good experience, so our superintendent nominated Columbia Middle School um, to work with Beautiful Day again. He had an idea as to what Beautiful Day could do for campus, but I had no idea. I thought that you know I was going to be working with 20, 20 to 30 people on a small project where you don't need a lot of skills. So it was uh, pretty shocking to me and exciting once I learned the scope of what Beautiful Day could do for a campus. One of the questions that comes with worship, I think that's beneath the question of worship is, how does my faith become a power that changes my life and the life of people around me? So if we just put worship in a box, it's something we do in a pew, in a traditional church that's very limiting. Anything that we do, to honor and give praise to who God is in the world in our life is worship. It would take me about three years to straighten out this library between being, you know, doing some tasks and then other tasks and then squeezing in the time it takes to, to do what's being done today by Beautiful Day. I feel blessed. The one that I've been bringing people in that that has been most exciting to see their reactions is the staff lounge. One of our teachers who even came in got choked up at just seeing the transformation. It's not just about what it looks like or you know what the teachers are going to be able to sit here, but it's about I think feeling really valued and appreciated. I don't think thank you is enough because it's not just about thank you for coming here. It was more than just painting. It was more than just organizing and cleaning. Um, it was about making, working together to make a group of people who at times feel a little underappreciated, feel valued, loved, feel special, um, and that's exciting for us. It's been great, actually. The, the whole experience has been great. The people working with them, I think this is the way people truly worship, is by serving. Talk is cheap, as they say, so you get out there and you do it. That's what we're doing here. We're pouring out a weekend of extravagant, unconditional love. And is there any better way to say that Jesus is real?